Robelis to Spain, 6'7", 87-inch reach. Three fights, 19 seconds heading into the UFC. You wonder, can this guy replicate that? What does he do, Chael? 18-second knockout. How impressed were you by this? Dude, he's running backwards, throwing right hands, and he knocks him out. Uh, I mean, Josh Parisian goes down flat. First win for Rebella to Spain, 18 seconds. Very impressive to me. The last time that I text John Jones, he took about five seconds to get back to me, and it was an emoji of a middle finger. Now, I tell you that story because I wanted to ask John Jones that question. I wanted to go to him so badly as a guy with length, right? As a guy with reach that's looked at this division and looked at other opponents, because I'm looking at him and saying, hey, from an MMA standpoint, you're breaking a lot of rules. Your hands are down, you're looping, your chin is up. But he got a lot of power, didn't he? And he knew where that target was. He was real good with range. And he's just a big enough boy. He's only got to get you one time. So I just shared, Daniel, when I watched him, if I was Clayton, Clayton Hires, my coach and trainer, there would have been a lot of things fundamentally that were off from what we're used to. But this is a little bit of a different striking art. We've never really seen somebody with Taekwondo at this level. I don't recall ever, not just in the heavyweight division of the UFC, I personally as a fan don't remember ever watching an Olympic medalist in Taekwondo go out and do this sport. If it's happened, I'm just sharing with you, partner, that I missed it. So I'm very open uh, to this young man. I do hope if he's watching this that he be just as open to hearing a couple of the basics and the fundamentals that we do with these little gloves on in that specific cage. I think if I was to bet... He could make some corrections. I think he's got to tighten a few things up. He sure does look impressive, though. He does look impressive, but you're right. There are some things that he needs to fix. But, Chael, here's the scary thought. He's only starting. And as we have seen time and time again, as guys go longer in their career, they keep getting better. Imagine this guy actually developing those skills and becoming a true heavyweight contender, someone that doesn't fight in that fashion. But the power is very impressive.